Hello and welcome to this video tutorial where I'll be showing you how to design your mobile application for iOS and Android. You can test our online app simulator for free by heading over to our website under Products, Mobile Application and clicking on Get Started. The first thing you'll need to do is give a name to your mobile app. Let's put My Radio. We recommend that you enter the name of your radio station so that your listeners can easily find you on the different stores. We've now reached the online app simulator. Under Stream Type, select whether your radio station has a Radio King stream or a different type of stream, such as Icecast, Shoutcast or other. If you have a Radio King stream, you'll then be able to select your radio station directly underneath. If you've selected a different type of stream, you'll need to enter your stream URL. If you need help configuring your radio stream, we invite you to follow the link to the written tutorial in the description box below. You can add multiple radio stations to your app, so if you'd like to add another stream, simply click on Add a Stream and complete the same steps as for the first stream. We're now going to upload a logo that will appear at the top of our app. When it comes to the design of your mobile application, there are three different themes available. Theme 1 Theme 2 and Theme 3 So for this example, I'm going to use Theme 3. It's then up to you to customise the theme to your liking, so let your imagination run wild. You can modify the interior design of your application at any time. All you have to do is return to the online app simulator once your app is published and make your changes. Select your colours and choose how you want them to appear on your app. OK, so when you're happy with your design, you can move on to the features and options of your app. You can easily activate options that will allow your listeners to share the music that they're listening to and even contact you directly via the app. You can add multiple tabs to your mobile app in order to make it more interactive and encourage your listeners to download it. For example, you can add your Facebook page, an RSS feed, quick access to your website, And you can also add a custom tab or allow your listeners to send you an audio shout out if you have a pro or business radio offer. You can change the name and icon of your tabs by clicking on them. Don't forget to select the language of your app too. Once you've finished configuring your app, click on Next Step. You'll now need to choose which mobile app offer you'd like to subscribe to. If you want your mobile app to be available on Android, you'll need to select our Start or Pro offer. If you want your app to be available on Android and iOS, you'll need to select our Business offer. In order for our team to publish your app, you must have your own Google Developer account for Android apps. This is priced at a $25 one-time fee to Google. For iOS apps, you'll need your own Apple Developer account, which is priced at $99 a year. Once you've chosen your offer and clicked on Order, you've arrived at the final steps of your app creation. You'll need to add various elements here, such as the app icon, the splash screen, or, if you have selected a pro or business offer, the images adapted for Apple TV and Android TV. To help you create your design, you can download our Photoshop templates in our mobile app creation guide. You'll find the link in the description below. You'll also need to add a description and keywords to help users easily find your app. If you're happy with your mobile app, you can now click on Publish App. You can find the details of your offer here. If everything is okay for you, click on Add to Cart and Checkout. 
Our team will take care of the rest. And there you have it. You now know how to create a mobile application for your radio station. Any questions? Head over to our knowledge base for more tutorials. They are categorized by product. Thanks for watching.